and YouTube. I did this three part um, five question or five answers um, for each. And it's just something for you to get to know me better. The first one I just said, what do you see? So when you see me, five things I feel like people see and they know without me ever having to say a word, without without question, that I'm a super sized big girl. That goes without saying. If you got vision, you see that. Without question, I'm a black woman. I'm black. There's no question. I'm not Hispanic. I'm not mixed. I'm not questionable. I'm black. <laughs> Without question, I'm female. Hear me roar. <laughs> I'm female. Without question, you see my hair salting and pepper. Well, I guess kind of depends on when you catch me. Because you catch me on a box color day, that might can fool you. But for the most part, <laughs> I'm very much gray. Um, and without question, I'm tall. So, super size big girl, black, female, salting and pepper hair, and I'm tall. That's five. Okay, now, when you go past what you see into what you hear when, you, when, I, when I speak or when I talk or whatever, I'm mostly bubbly um, most times. Kind of funny. That's two. I'm goofy on occasions. <laughs> Not as goofy as those so blessed one, but goofy on occasions. I'm honest. Um, especially if you ask my opinion, I'm honest. And I'm pleasant. Five. So bubbly, kind of funny, goofy, honest, and pleasant. That sums it up pretty much. And things that you can't see. Um, I'm sensitive. Not as bold as I would like. Sometimes I just really wish I had like a mega dose of boldness some days. But I'm not as bold as I would like to be. Like I say, I defend myself if an issue or something is going on. But I'm not as bold as I would I would really like to be. I'm a crybaby. I cry at the drop of a dime. Especially if it's something that's really wearing my heart out. I will cry over. I'll cry at just the thought of crying. So let me stop before I start crying. <laughs> um, I'm afraid sometimes. I don't really know where that stems from and I don't know why but sometimes I just get afraid. Um, I don't like to stop like once I leave from home to go to work I don't want to stop on my route to even get gas or whatever and I guess this partly because the world is just gone so crazy that I I'm not very comfortable with getting out I'm afraid um, I go to a, an odd part of town um, and it can be white or black if it's something that's bugging me I'm in the air I'm afraid so it can be white what I feel is a white redneck town or you know deep in the ghetto it doesn't matter if there's something that's bugging my insides I'm afraid um, and number five sad I'm sad sometimes now not not all the time and it's not like a depression and it's not like where somebody needs to haul me off to, you know, the loony bin. But I, I get sad, really sad. And sometimes it's overwhelming. And I just cry. So, um, mostly it's when there's some type of upset amongst my family. If, you know, if one sibling is mad at the other, it brings me sadness. If you know, me and my husband are arguing and fighting. It brings me sadness. Um, if my kids are at odds with each other, you know, like really having a day of bickering, it saddens me. So different things will trigger it, but 
more than anything, it's normally when there's an upset within my family unit. You know, other people don't necessarily make me sad like outsiders. It's more so when it's my close-knit family, my sisters, my mom, my dad, my you know, my family, my kids, my husband. That's normally the the makeup of who can make me sad. And when things are just not going right, I get sad. So, that's the five for the things you can't see. Sensitive, not as bold, crybaby, afraid, and sad. That's five. Tell me some of yours. So, so blessed. I know you like answering questions. I try to think of questions and I don't have like really good questions yet. I have not really tapped into my deal yet. But anyway, so answer those. What do you see when we first look at you? What will we see, what will hear, what will come out, you know, when we hear you. And tell us something that we can't see. Alrighty. Bye-bye.